Hey guys, we're back again with another video and we're going to get right into it. Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Religion Wing TV. You're watching Religion Wing TV and my spiritual ears stay. I just have a little encouraging word for you all. You don't have to convince me that you're amazing, that you're brave, or that you're strong. For the love of God, he knows it and I know it as well. So to those of you that rock with me, that support me, that, um, you know, whatever kind of support you give me financially, click a view, um, you know, text me, call me, see how I'm doing. I appreciate that, guys. I really do. It's not easy being in a big old ocean with a bunch of piranhas. And you're the only sweet belly bass <laughs> in the water, right? So that being said, guys, I'm going to go ahead and let you watch this video. I'm trying this new recording here in this software. I really don't like the camera. It's kind of dark. Um, but it'll do for now. So with that being said, guys, thank you so much. You are amazing. You are brave and you are strong. If you have been battling the COVID and whatever else you've been battling in your life, I'm just here to tell you through it all, you are amazing. You are brave and you are strong. And I love you for that, guys. Thank you. I appreciate you. I really do appreciate See, you guys. Looking, looking at, Thank you so much. We're going to get it together eventually. Oh, and we got it together. Else is working the camera and doing everything. Yeah, girl, my eyes be like right there. Okay, God bless you. You're watching Religion with TV and my spiritual gifts. All right, guys. Bye. You are amazing, you are brave, you are strong. And you don't have to convince me of this at all, you all. If you're following me and rocking with me, you must be amazing, you must be brave, and you must be strong. If you're amazing, if you are brave, and if you are strong, those are three things right there you could be thankful for on a day-to-day -day basis. Those three things right there can inspire a whole nation, the world. If every individual begins to believe that they're amazing, believe that they are brave, and believe that they are strong, we can take down the, the greatest enemy ever. But you have to be amazing. You have to be brave. And you have to be strong in order to fight or stand up against the wiles of the enemy. And the darts that he may be throwing at you day to day. Say it with me. You are amazing. You are brave. You are strong. You are amazing. You are brave. You are strong. You are amazing, you are brave, you are strong. Guys, keep meditating on this day and night. And you will begin to feel amazing. You will begin to feel brave. 
and you will begin to feel strong. Hell, I know you are amazing. I know you are brave. And I know you are strong. But for those of you out there who don't believe this as much as you would like to, I'm here to encourage you that you are amazing, you are brave, and you are strong. Until you begin to believe these things about yourself, who will you be able to convince that you are amazing, you are brave, and that you are strong? If you don't begin to believe this about yourself, please believe this, people. But if you don't begin to believe this about yourself, then there's a form of weakness that comes along with not being amazing, not being brave, and not being strong. I don't want you to be weak, people. Everybody at the gunfight is not brave. And they definitely aren't strong because amazing, brave, and strong people sometimes will avoid the gunfight. You understand what I'm saying? Everybody that run out to see the fight doesn't always necessarily know how to fight. And for some people, it's a fight just to get up in the morning. It's a fight just to get up and make their bed, make them something to eat. Think, for goodness sake. It's hard for some people to think right now the way the world is. But in the midst of it all, you guys, I'm here to tell you, you are amazing, you are brave, and you are strong. If there's people in your life and they're not encouraging you, you don't have to convince me at all. You don't have to convince me at all that you are amazing, you are brave, and you are strong. But if you have people in your life that's not encouraging you, And that you always have to prove yourself to. And you always have to convince them that you are amazing. You are brave and you are strong. Then these people don't have your best interests at heart. Every person I know, I encourage encourage them and tell them. That they are amazing, that they are brave, and that they are strong. A lot of times you have to speak to the inner man. People don't know that they're amazing. People don't know that they're brave. And people surely don't know that they're strong. Considering everything people have been through in this world, you still rise from the ashes as an amazing person to me. You still rise from the ashes as a brave person to me. And you still rise out of the ashes as a strong person to me. 
This is what overcoming is all about, people. Being strong and brave make you amazing. Being amazing and brave make you strong. And I already know this. I already know you are amazing. I already know you are are brave. I already know that you are strong. When you're amazing and strong, amazingly strong, it makes you brave. When you are amazingly brave, it makes you strong. When you are brave and strong, it makes you an amazing person. Joshua 1 and 9 says, Joshua 1 and 9 says, You're amazing, you are brave, and you are strong. This is what the Lord was telling Joshua, right? (laughs) Here we go, people. Joshua 1 and 9. Have not I commanded thee, be strong and of good courage. Be not afraid, neither be thou dismayed. For the Lord thy God is with thee, whithersoever thou goest. Joshua was on his way to battle. He was on his way to fight the battle of Jericho. And that was an amazing event in history. They had to march around the wall seven times in order for that wall to come down in order for God's people to enter in and take over the promised land. Joshua did an amazing thing leading the people to battle. Joshua was brave and Joshua was strong. Now if God had to tell Joshua to be of good courage and fear not, be not afraid, what is he telling us? Thanks so much for watching, guys. Subscribe, like, share, and comment. Shalom and God bless. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this little mantra of meditation and inspiration. We all going through some things, guys. And um, I just want you to know that I recognize you. I acknowledge you. And I am inspired by you. Every time you comment, every time you click, every time you view, every time you reach out to me, it encourages me to come forward and do more for you. So, you know, one hand washes the other, and they both wash the face and the body, right? And I hope you guys are encouraged by this content. It was just a little 10-minute video I wanted to upload just to take a break from all the monotonous content we be doing on this channel right so hopefully guys maybe i can go live later if you guys show up it's a blessing if you guys don't show up it's still a blessing but with that being said i appreciate you for getting me where i am today i really do appreciate you guys i appreciate you guys i'm drew god bless you stay shalom Peace, everybody. Peace, guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. You are amazing. We're get there, guys. You are brave and you are strong. 
honestly. I love you guys. Full of integrity. By the time we get to 1K, okay, we're still going to have our integrity. And with that being said, God bless you. God bless you guys. Peace.